The Smart Modified Tour, powered by Pacematic, coming at you from Orange County. Tim Brown rockets to the lead by Caden Lapsovich. Keep an eye on drivers like Brandon Ward right there in the number two machine. He's got more experience at this racetrack than any other driver. There are some of the team cars for SNS Racing. Jonathan Cash in the 16 on the outside of Danny Bone. Jonathan Cash, a former late model winner here at Orange County Speedway, brought his family, brought his friends here. He lives 15 minutes down the road and he's already up to the third spot. Great run for Jonathan Cash. Here comes Bobby Labani as well. Labani on the outside, Labani. A top five run for him in 1992 here at Orange County Speedway in the old NASCAR Bush Series. He moves into fourth by Danny Bone. Danny Bone, last time he was here at Orange County Speedway, 2017. He's the driver of that number 24, and he won back in 2017. Battle for the lead. Lapsovich on the inside of Tim Brown. Lapsovich trying to get by the rocket. Tim Brown, he's going to be able to do it. Coming to the stripe here, 17 laps complete. Lapsovich, oh, slides up a little bit. That car did not want to turn coming off the corner. Tim Brown told us during the Pacematic pit party he was hungry for a Smarty Trophy. And Brown back to the front. They swap leads here in the opening 20 laps of this race. But he knows he's got his eye on the prize here tonight, and he says he loves this racetrack. A little contact there possibly between Bobby Labonte and Keaton Lapsovich. Labani going to the inside of Lapsovich. Lapsovich says, okay, let him go early, trying to save my stuff. Bobby Labani now up to second. Tim Brown now under fire. Bobby Labani has had a good race car the last couple of weeks. Bobby Labani with the win at Tri-County Speedway in Hudson, North Carolina about three weeks ago. A couple of weeks ago. A finish just outside the top five for Bobby Labonte at South Boston Speedway in Virginia. And now a little bump there. Brown up the racetrack. Labonte on the inside. Labonte driving the pace of Matic. Cookout units moving in storage number 18 machine. Brown able to keep Labonte at bay at least for now. Brown in that Hayes Jewelers. Jerry Hunt Super Center 25. Mike Smith. Andretti prepares that race car. It's one of the finest looking machines in Southern Modified competition. And here's a great shot of the perspective of the lead battle between Tim Brown and Bobby Labonte. Labonte trying to use some of that 19 degrees of banking here at Orange County Speedway. And by the way, thanks to Carolina Drilling and for Citrus Safe Grill Cleaners for providing the drone coverage to us tonight on our Flow Racing broadcast. Labonte is hungry, wants to end the season on the right note. Finished just outside of the opportunity to battle for a championship here tonight. He finished fourth heading into this one. Trying to keep that fourth spot. And Tim Brown now coming to the pink and white checkered flag to denote the end of Bell Helmet segment number one. On the gas at the pace matic restart zone and to the line. We're back to green here with the Smart Modified Tour at Rougemont. Tim Brown up front. A little bit further back. Bobby Labani trying to make his way through. Burt Myers back there as well. Hey, let's show you the Catalanos. The number, oh, and as I say that, we got a battle for the lead. We'll go back to the battle for the lead. Caden Lapsevich put his nose to the inside of Tim Brown. We want to show you all the racing action that we can, but Lapsovich made it interesting there, hounding Tim Brown on his back bumper. Lapsovich does not want to punish those tires too much, though. And he's digging to the inside, trying to get an edge on the 25 of Tim Brown in that Ter Jerry Hunt Supercenter race car. Caden Lapsovich, Tim Brown going at it. Side by side they go, coming to the strike. Closing in on the banker's life halfway point in this race. Caden Lapsovich grabs the lead again from Tim Brown. And now here comes the ace, Burt Myers. Burt Myers to second as well. Joey Coulter is there in that rum runner racing number 02. 
He too moves by Tim Brown. So the top three now, Caden Lapsovich, Burt Myers, and Joey Coulter. Coulter pounds the back end of Burt Myers. And then it looks like Ryan Newman got into Joey Coulter. So Newman, remember, pitted because he had that tire on the front end of that car with a screw in it after the pit party. And there goes Joey Coulter to the front. Coulter gets by the 76 of Caden Lapsovich. We got all sorts of movers and shakers here early in the race. I should say midway point now for the Smart Modified Tour powered by pace -Matic. We told you about two. Oh, we got a spinner on the back stretch. Right off a of turn number two, about halfway down the back stretch, and there it is. Trevor Catalano from New York winds up spinning off a of turn number two. Brown is down there. Jason Myers, Danny Bone, Brian Lofton, Burt Myers. Brandon Ward gets off a of pit road here. Tim Brown having to back up, did not get into his stall. A very tight pit road at Orange County Speedway. Brandon Ward makes it out in front of Joey Coulter in terms of some of the cars that pitted, but there are several other cars that pitted on the backstretch that had even better stops, including Ryan Newman, Bobby Labonte, and also Tommy Catalano. Ryan Newman digging hard on the inside. The race down into turn number one. Labonte grabs the lead. Ryan Newman, trouble. Catalano way up the racetrack, got pushed up there as Ryan Newman slipped up just a little bit. And Catalano out of the top five in the latter part of the top ten now. Bad break for Tommy Catalano. Going to try to rebound. He's hard on the mat, battling with Jonathan Cash in the number 16. But Catalano, man, oh, man. Got trapped on the outside groove coming off of turn number two. Not right now, Tommy Catalano way back in ninth. They're side by side. Danny Bone and Burt Myers. That is a battle for fifth. Bone trying to get back into the top five. Burt Myers wants win number four on the season. He's already the champ of the Smart Modified Tour powered by pace -Matic. And there's his brother Jason as well. Bobby Labonte. This time by. Bobby Labonte, red hot on the Smart Modified Tour, powered by pace -Matic. He wins the season finale.